Loading snacks. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Your boy Sin here at AwesomeCon 2024. Awesome God! Yes. Awesome. <laughs> here we go. See, y'all here to love, uh, but y'all know the routine by now. It's day three. Caught something interesting. Got to share with you guys. Please introduce yourself to everybody home. And hey, my name is Carlos Davis. Uh, this is Creative Mind Development. My name is Andrew. All right, so, Carlos, I'm looking here. I see a lot of interesting things. I see a lot of asthma to advertisements with anime going on. How did this come together? Well, actually, uh, it's really just based off my upbringing, you know what I'm saying? You know, I was always a big fan of anime, you know, and just growing up seeing uh, the collaboration of products like, uh, for example, Muscle and Fitness and Dragon Ball Z. I just come up with the concepts and just uh, fuse them together. So that's where a lot of the inspiration comes from. Okay, uh, for instance, I'm looking at the ramen with Naruto. Okay. What made you pick those flavors for these characters? Man, really, I try to have the flavors adapt to their personalities pretty much. So for like example, you know, just on top of the color coordination, and the color theory of the layout. I try to have a lot of flow and a lot of fluidity between both of all, between the brand itself and the characters. And that's how some of it came about. Do you have a favorite piece up here right now? Man, you know what? I always gotta go with the first round, first pick, what started it all. You know, it might, some people might think it's the Maruton, some people might think it's the DBZ, but in all actuality, it's the Power of Girl Z. Really? You know, I had to fuse both of them together. That's what it all started. That was the epitome of it, and now we're here. What, what, what made that be the beginning that let everything do, just take off? Because from, I, you know, I'm not ashamed to say, I'm uh, always and have been a big Cartoon Network fan. You know okay. what I'm saying? Even with Power of girls and I realized that a lot of people didn't know about powerful girls Z. So I was like, man, what how dope would it be if I could get the powerful girls from the Cartoon Network and the powerful girls from the anime version and fuse them together. Right. Did some test runs, a lot of people saw it and I had a really great response to it okay. and it all blew up away from there. Okay, is there any fandoms that you haven't touched yet that you asked a lot for and yes. you're gonna add to? Yes, yes sir, okay. yes sir. So Power Rangers, that's also a big one. So one thing I got directly in the shoot right now is uh, Pacific Rim, and I'm using the Megazord from uh, okay. the very first original Power Rangers for okay. the first one. The second one I got coming for Pacific Rim 2, I'm gonna have Dino Zord from Green Ranger, dog. You know you gotta throw the evil Green Ranger gotcha. in there. So those gotcha. are the next ones in the shoot. Okay, okay, and how long have you been doing this for? Man, uh, well I've been drawing for life. You know, it's been a lifelong journey, self-taught 100% of the way. Um, I've been actually doing the crossovers for about, for about four years strong now. Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. You're, you're, also, you're obviously a fellow anime fan, so I gotta ask, what is your favorite anime? Man, favorite anime? Would you, okay, let me ask you this question real quick. Would you consider Last Airbender anime? No, but I will give it a pass. Okay, right on. Hey, much appreciated. I would have to go with, I would have to go with Last Avatar. Reason being because it's a story that's designed to end with the first three seasons, and long story short, it encompasses every emotion. Great storyline, great character development, great protagonist, great antagonist, but if we had to take that one off, I would either go with the OGs, Ronin Warriors. Can't go wrong Ooh, with that. Not mad at that. Hey. Not mad at that. Good retro pick. I like yes, that sir. Much appreciated. Hey, look, whoever's not here at AwesomeCon, how can they find you online, track what you're doing, and pick up one of these beautiful works of art? Much appreciated. Brilliant question. Uh, uh, creativemindevelopment.com that's where we have a whole catalog we keep the update we keep the website updated constantly so uh we do ship uh domestic and international you can send messages for commissions as well and uh we're here for the people so i just appreciate the time hey look i appreciate you taking the time to talk with us man hey thank you brother hey look day three y'all know what it is we gotta hurry up and get some stuff done before we get out of here so do some time hey what's going on everybody did you enjoy what you saw of course you did so if you want to help us out and support us, here's what you can do. On whatever platform you're currently streaming us on, just like, share, and subscribe. Then head over to patreon.com forward slash Snacks and become one of our patrons there.